There's only one role. Just try to stand next to the bride and look okay, and make her look good, okay? I killed it! <laughs> The other thing that I wanted to give, I need the microphone last because Derek was going to proceed. So we'll get to that in just a minute. I cannot express the gratitude of everyone being here tonight. The party is made by the participants. That's how it works. It's not the host, it's the participants. And everybody's here. It's overwhelmingly uh, positive to Julian, to myself, and we. And I thank you enough. So thank you, thank, thank you. you, thank you. So where did it begin? <laughs> well, I got introduced to Julie's family, and I've grown to love them. Two sets of twins. What's the chances of that? These little guys finally gave up the ring. God bless. <laughs> Born within like five, six weeks of each other. Crazy. Positive. So fun. We've got Julie's friends who have taken me in. Bo. 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 <laughs> okay, I appreciate it. Thank you. And they're amazing people. They're amazing people. People over there. And we have, in fact, one of the distinguished uh, Coloradans. We have Judge Al here. And Judge Al has touched a lot of people, and he touched my bride, Julie, and done nothing but positive in this world. So I want to give a shout out to Judge Al for everything he's done over his life. And then we have my family, first and foremost. So last night, I have two world-class superstar sons. <laughs> that is the greatest blessing one could ever, ever have. And I've always said that they're going to change this world for the better, and they are well on their way to doing that. And I could not be more proud to be associated and be in the lives of these two great human beings. So thank you. And my family, last night we had a rehearsal, except we didn't do the rehearsal dinner. We didn't, we didn't do the rehearsal, but we had the rehearsal dinner. And Nikolai hosted that at his wonderful place. And we had the family together. And in honor of keeping it real, Claire, our mother, yes. there is no quarter given in our family. And it's done with love and affection. And we did the, at the end of the night, we did a circle. And we all just told stories that we've done many times, uh, including one of the most powerful memories we all had of my uh, dad's 85th, and shared stories. And Nikolai and Alexander love hearing the stories of us growing up. Just like, what the hell was going on? <laughs> How did our parents not get arrested? We were child neglect? <laughs> but they were different times when we did it. And Julie said, "Are you not going to let you know, like Paul, give a toast?" And I said. I would, but it's just going to be a story where he ends up being the hero. <laughs> wow, who saw that coming? Okay. He puts a broom into my eyes, but he's helping me out. Okay. So thank you for Paul, thank you for Jeff, who tried to keep up all he could. <laughs> And to Jean, who we did find out, I was about 14. And she's our sister, which is fantastic. <laughs> so my parents, who God knows, after four kids like this, like, let's get the hell out of Dodge. And they had many times they would go out to eat. And we had babysitters until that one time I was like two. We had a babysitter, we came out, and she's going through the rules, our mom, our lovely mom, about the story. And we come out naked, jumping around. <laughs> And that was probably the last that babysitter ever came out. Okay? So then Jean inherited the job. And that was the deal. Was like, Mom would get the meal going. It would be going great. And so I'm going to stove Jean and come out there. And it'll be ready in 15 minutes. Okay. So she would do that. And we're like messing around or watching TV or whatever kind of lazy ass thing we could do. And Jean would quietly go, turn off the stove, 
serve herself a plate, <laughs> escort herself to her room, <laughs> lock the door, <laughs> and announce <Yes>, nothing. <laughs> 30 minutes, 40 minutes later, God, we're having a good day. What the hell's going on? It's cold, or it's burnt, or it's whatever. <laughs> Thank you, Jean, for all these great But in her defense, I was put into her bedroom, and everybody can appreciate that. As a five, six, seven year old boy, I was sharing a room with my sister. She didn't take to that too much. <laughs> but she embraced me as a baby because she had had, as the oldest, seen Brother Paul come, seen Brother Jeff. Mom was pregnant again, it's all gonna happen. She's counting on another baby, or a sister to come along. She wants a girl. Jean, my parents said, we got a baby brother for you. Bruce. She goes, leave him there. <laughs> I think she grew past that. I'm not so sure. I'm going to save this table for a little bit. <laughs> so then we have the people that pay for everything. <laughs> and that is my partner. So first of all, we have two clients here who really pay for everything. <laughs> And Chris, his wife, from California came out. God bless it. John and I go way back. So I had a former company called Flatiron, and then we did National Partners. And John was in both parts of that, and we developed an amazing relationship. Except, again, he pays us, and we just welcome him. To the <laughs> but when we started National Partner after Flatiron, you have to have a first client. And that is David A. Bradley. And so, but when I came to saw him, he says, well, how many clients do you have? And I said, well, less than 100. <laughs> That's totally accurate. Maybe a bit misleading. Okay? And David said, I was telling him, listen, we're doing great things. He said, just save it because you're a pal and I'll give you the business. And I can't tell you what that meant to us. And this is the guy right here. And you want to go to Ireland, and you need the weather to cooperate, this is the guy. <laughs> Thank you, Julie's friends, for being here and sharing that. Heather, did she crush it as the yeah. Yeah, baby? Woo! Such a long time friend here at Garden. He was very special to us all. Everybody's special to us, but everybody's been so beautiful to Julie, and they've taken me in, and I appreciate that. And this is the friends that uh, 